Morning, morning. All sorts of things going on here. It was a blustery night. The weather is bad outside. It's been just really, really windy all night. But I've slept like a baby. There's bagpipes going off to wake you up. <laughs> so I'm going to get up, make a brew. Oh, I've got an expedition food. Scrambled egg and all sorts of things in it. It's like 700 odd calories, so that's brilliant. I'm going to get that. And then somehow I'll get this thing packed away. Just waiting for a coffee. I've drank most of my coffee, but I've got one of these. Gonna have food as well, so I've just rehydrated my scrambled egg with cheese, caramelised onion, um, 800 calories, 46 grams of protein, which is amazing. As you can probably hear, it is throwing it down outside, it's windy. Um, we start at quarter to eight, and the sun comes up at five past eight. Everyone's backing away, quite a few of the competitors are already going. That's where I was last night. I just wanted to show you, I have a X-Mid solid, not pro, and the top tip, if you've got one, get yourself a Ladshack 2 bag, look at that, so you ditch its existing bag, you put it in a little Ladshack bag, that's with the inner and everything, absolutely tiny, so I'm going to throw that in there now, Andy's going to pack down, and then we're going to set off and look at this. We've seen people, we've seen people go to the top of here. They're, probably, they're doing different courses and a lot going over here. And going up. And they're going all the way up to the top there. Looks like a big, big climb. Feeling all right so far. The great thing is I found some electrolytes in my bag, so I'm gonna go get some water and things from the top up and start guzzling that out in advance. Hopefully, I'd like to check is the thighs are sore. Right, all stocked up on water. I'm taking, um, taking 1600 mil today so i've got a litre bottle and a 600 mil my 600 mil has got all my electrolytes in it i didn't want to carry any water yesterday so i just took my um my catadin b3 and that's not smart so I'm taking plenty of water today my bag feels light anyway all ready to go all kitted out poles out from day one just waiting for andy our start time's kind of here been and gone so just need to find andy let's get to the start get our map and get cracking I was waiting up there, thinking, I was thinking you up there. Ah, you got your water and everything? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You started with us at the end down there. You just wait here for me. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Uh, check it. See, so, yeah, I've got a minute here, and then a minute in each of the boxes to check your map. Okay. And then start with us at the end down there. Cheers, thanks. Cheers. Right, we're all set from the camp. I pointed on top of that hill before. That's where we're heading with everybody else. And we can we could already see the point where we've got a divot from the bottom. That's where we're heading. There's Andy in the middle. <laughs> so far, so good. It's forecast to be heavy rain now, but it's not in it. So I hope it stays like this. I'm going high for a 40 points. 50 points is a maximum. 40s. High. There's not many 40s. Ah, it's just relentless, it's just up and up and up. And it keeps going. Steep climb up, but we're rewarded with our first one of the day. Let's get Let's go over the ridge and look what we've got tackling us now. Yeah. And now upwards. Teamwork makes the dream work. It's just up there, the dibber, but luckily Andy's got the bit to tag. There he is crawling up. But as long as one of us tags it and I'm not too far away from him, I've got a GPS on my bag there. And next, after this, have a look at what we've got to come down. Really steep. And it's very slippy as well. Yeah, it's been pretty brutal so far, but doing all right. Every time I stop, I make sure I get some water. I'm now going to get rid of this hat because it's too warm. But yeah, so far, so good. Woo! Here we go. Get back to normal, Chris. Perfect. I'll show you what we've just done now. Here we go. We went to AU. That's what we started. We come up to AB20 and now we're at Beef this bi-40 and i think we're going to come across here now 
and tag this AJ40 here. I thought I thought we were going to come around this way, but it's just too far. So yeah, I think we're going to head to AJ40 next. So it's down this scree slope along the path and past that hut. I feel like I should have filmed coming down here. I literally, I thought I'll sit down and slide. Just slid all the way down on his backside. I've come down half the hill. <laughs> I'm covered in crap. Thought it was the way down. <laughs> Are you finding it so far? Steep coming up on it, but this is all right. Really steep, it was really steep coming down though. Yeah, but I'd rather this start than yesterday. Yesterday was just up and up and up and up and up. It just kept going, didn't it? Another jacket gone. Keep on the watch life today. They're going to be the trick. Little run on the flat, make up a little bit of time. Not much running, but, you know. Feeling so much stronger today. Legs are feeling good. Just been all the way up there. You can see all the people, like ants behind. Two tagged. We've got another one up this hill. And then decisions on what to do next. Past the hut. Up to the top. Not rain though. I think after this one we need to make decisions, don't we? Whether we go for the whether we stay high, go for the 40 and 50. Let's have a look. You can see the next marker up here, AJ. This has been a brutal climb. There we go. Dipped. Straight up the mountain. Flagging on this bit, for sure. This one's been a right slog. Look at all those people. So steep. But the summit, just up there, where that rock is. We hit the summit, and this is the valley. Look at this. The wind is just bitter today but look at this it's stunning and right in the far distance that's where our finish point is today there's a point kind of down here 30 pointer we're not too sure where it heads either stays low or there's people coming this way and it looks brutal but up onto the top of there and we think that's a 50 pointer so we don't want to climb up here it's worth 20 points more, so I'm going to go for it. At least we've got a little bit of rest by now, after that brutal climb. It's so windy, I'm just going to get down below the wind, sit down, Oh. Just had a few minutes to put my jacket and gloves on. Put it. Just noticed all my bag ripped. Just landed down before new bag. That's stitched. In fact, we're heading down here. Some people low down as well, so I need to check where it is. A little bit undulating on this ridge line, but it's, it's heading back towards the finish. And then I think we've got a bit of a steep climb down. There's quite a few more points to tag along here. We're just over halfway, I think, in time-wise. I'm going for two and a half hours. It's a stunning day, though. All the rain that was forecast hasn't shown. There's a point to your right which you can get, but it's literally the steepest descent and then a massive ascent for 40 points. The finish is over there, but there's loads more kind of up in the hills, so we've decided to take the easier way down. Finally. And now it's whether we go up there or straight across. Let's see. Somehow get across here. It's quite deep, fast flowing.
Yes. Boom. <laughs> Made our next point. Andy's just dipping it. That's another one ticks off. Yesterday. Just have a minute. Yeah, yeah, go for it. Well done, mate. So, how many points? What you say? Same as yesterday. Two hundred and ten points. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, that's amazing. Two hundred and ten today, and we got two hundred and ten yesterday. But today we're only out for five hours. Yesterday was six. So we've gone for some more higher pointers today. We've been going for about three hours fifty-five. Here's some of the scenery that we've experience today luckily we've been on the right side of rain just made it quite a bit more enjoyable we decided the last minute to come up a steep one to try and tag two up here oh fuck my life <laughs> right i missed tagging that last one but we've just tagged the 50 pointer <laughs> at the end yeah, I would say today was a little bit easier to navigate the points apart from one. Yeah. But we struggled yeah. with the sheet fold one. And then um, we've certainly been sneaker today. We just have one more hour. Yeah. Mind you, everyone probably says that. Oh gosh. Oh, incoming. <laughs> The last downhill, and we get to the finish. Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> Let's run past the finish line. Well done, Annie. It's been a pleasure. Ah, <laughs> Did enjoy that. Honestly, we've landed with the weather today. It's been brilliant, been beautiful. Yeah, thank you. Free wrap at the finish. Bonus. Three <laughs> hundred. Yeah. Nice to sit down as well. So I'll just show you our score from today. So this is what we've done so far. Two fifty. 460 overall. Oh, we got 40 points more than yesterday, and it was one hour shorter, so we've done well. We're happy with that, anyways. We only came to take part, so we've done really well. I'm going to eat this, and then I'll give a little summary. <laughs> Absolutely glad to see you. You got food on your face. <laughs> Chopping my face. Right, that's a wrap. We did it. Cheers. Fist. Absolutely legend. So, you know what? It's been brilliant as well. Really enjoyed it. Challenging. We've had a laugh. It's been great. Highly, highly recommend it. Anyone that's like a seasoned hiker or a backpacker, give it a go. Chris had less than 24 hours notice to take this on. So massive, massive credit to Chris. Because it's an intimidating event, there's no doubt about it. Yeah. And it was well worth it, wasn't it? Yeah. No regrets? No, no regrets. It was tough yesterday. I, I know I moaned a lot yesterday because I had cramped, just hadn't hydrated, right? So it was tough and I felt I was holding Andy back, but... The weather was supposed to be awful, but we've looked out, it's been gorgeous. Yeah. I really recommend doing it. And I'd say as well, you've got to be fit. You don't have to be a runner either. Not as many people run as you'd, as you'd think. You can hike it and, you know, jog in little bits, but it's doable. So yeah, definitely a challenge with a backpack on. It's got to be one of the ultimate, ultimate backpacking challenges, right. without a doubt. Yeah. Certainly, just push yourself really hard for three days. I'd say one of the biggest learns from this, don't focus too much on your pack weight. So we were obsessed with it, packing, repacking, taking this out, taking that out. Our backpacks yeah. weren't an issue. Don't scrimp on feet. That is number one. That has got to be the number one lesson there. Yeah. Especially me. <laughs> I fell for Andy last night. Half past three, Andy had his meal. I had my emergency food and then eight o'clock last night, Lovely spag ball. Yeah. <laughs> Loved every minute of it. Right. Cheers, yeah, cheers, thanks, cheers, mate. Yeah, good to meet you finally as well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Legend. Right, we've had our food, we've had our beer, and that's the end of it this week. He didn't give me much notice, <laughs> but please subscribe to Andy. You're probably doing it already if you follow my channel, but he's a legend. 
he put up with me yesterday, moaning yeah. about my cramp all day. Um, but it's been good, hasn't it? It's been superb, absolutely superb. Yeah, really very, enjoyed it. Very memorable. <laughs> Won't forget this, that's for sure. Yeah, we've been blessed with the weather. It's been a laugh, it's been tough as well. But um, yeah, I'm going to do it again, maybe. <laughs> Massively rewarding. It <laughs> yeah. is rewarding. You can you can say you've done it now. That's it. That's yeah. It. Oh, it's been brilliant, honestly. Andy's been a legend. Lovely to meet you as well. So subscribe to his channel. Thanks for watching. Drop a like and a subscribe. Come on. If you've not done it already, get it clicked. But I'll, uh, I'll see you on the next one. Peace out. <laughs>